And within the past hour, word of four senators working on a bipartisan proposal to strike the provision from the law. Woohoo! Rich Hansen in D.C. with more. It looks like good guys are winning here, Rich. Top members of the Senate Judiciary Committee, two Democrats, two Republicans, are proposing to rescind the authority the financial law has just given the SEC. Judiciary Committee Chairman Patrick Leahy and Senators Ted Kaufman, Chuck Grassley, and John Cornyn have introduced a proposal to eliminate that provision, that exemption, for certain records to be kept at the SEC. In their release, Senator Cornyn writes, if anything, the financial crisis and the wave of financial frauds we have seen over the past few years call for more transparency at the SEC, not less. Chairman Leahy says he's been troubled by the sweeping interpretation the SEC has expressed on this provision. Meanwhile, in the House, an aide to Financial Services Chairman Barney Frank says the committee has moved up its hearing date to September 16th. That's a week earlier. Committee Republicans are weighing in on the hearing. Congressman Scott Garrett of New Jersey says it's safe to say this hearing will be just the first installment of what will prove to be a long series of follow-up hearings to examine the fallout from this misguided legislation. Democrats admit they'll need to write a second bill with technical corrections to fix unexpected problems with this sweeping new law.